Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Alan. Hey, I seen a question the other day on Facebook about tapering the tops of uh, of smokers of the vertical chambers. And I've seen people asking before, and I was going to show you what I do on mine. It was actually a picture of mine that they were asking on. But uh, this is what people have been asking about. How to taper it off. And that's a different one over there, but it's the same taper. And I don't really have a magic formula for this. Mine were kind of done by trial and error. But if you're doing a smoker, this one is 20 inches, 20 by 20, with a five inch piece right here. This one is 24 by 24, with a four inch piece right there. Actually, they're both like four and an eighth and five and an eighth, but it could be five and four. And those are cut at 35 degrees. Pretty much any of them that you're doing, no matter the size, 35 degrees is gonna be just about what you're looking for. You're gonna be somewhere between 25 and 35. If you go too much, if you go down to 40, it's getting real close to flat, especially with thinner plate, it's gonna be real close to flat. So about 35 degrees, and all I do, if you got a certain one, I got some plates cut out here, and I'll show you how to uh, get the measurement on how to get the angle on them, and how to do it a, a certain size on the top if you wanted to. So these are cut at the same, it's gonna be the same chamber that we just looked at, that 20 by 20. And like I say, those are 35, and I just kinda of came to 35. I started, like I said, about 25, and started cutting more. But the thing was, the guy was asking because he didn't want to waste material, but still the sky high, everybody knows. But all you gotta do is cut your piece out, that's five by 20 and 35 degrees on your square. Just line your corner up over there, your 35 on the close edge to you. If you wanted the top to be a certain size, say these are 20, if I wanted this to be 16 on the top, the top piece, just measure, get your mark in the middle and come back from each side. If I wanted it to be 16, come eight inches both sides, both ways from that line. And that's gonna give you that top piece. And then you would see what that angle is. Just a second, I'll look at it and see what that angle is. And that put that right at under 20, right under 20, probably 19. And if I see that, then I auto automatically know that's too small. That's gonna be not far from standing up straight. And you're gonna want a little more taper than that. So the best thing you can do is either go to 25, start at 25 and cut up to 35. Pretty positive it's not gonna be over 35. I've never used one over 35. And if you still just need to guess at it, I mean, cut that out of cardboard. It's a little worrisome to take the time to cut up cardboard and stuff and do all that. Take the time to do it just to throw it away. But it will tell you what you're looking at. If you cut it, cut your same strips out, same length, the same width, and then just, you can even cut uh, start at a smaller angle on that. Start at 25, set it up, see how it looks. Uh, cut it to 30. But if you just want to cut the first time, if you're using a plate, I'd say anywhere from four inches to six inches wide and probably 18 to probably 30 long, 35 degrees is what it's gonna be. So anyway, I'm gonna cut these up, and if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.